good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's Smash Mode. Could also say good morning. It is 1 a.m. I wanted to do a Labyrinth playthrough tonight, but unfortunately, there is a, a situation with the kiddos, and they cannot take the bus in the morning. Well, one of the kiddos, because they have to be at school at 6 a.m. for choir practice. <laughs> so we need to wake up in about four hours. I figured today we would take a little tour of where you might be at if you've been playing free-to-play. I know a lot of times people think that free-to-play is not an option in these games, but what I like about Lilith the Games, in my experience, is yes, there is a, a big pay-to-win aspect, but you can survive free-to-play and you can enjoy their games free-to-play. So first with the campaign, we were able to get to level 812, and honestly, I was having a lot of trouble until I started just switching up my formation in ways that I never would have thought of. And I'm going to just show you real quick. We're, there, we have no chance of winning this battle. But I noticed that my legendary mage had a much higher, and I mean significantly higher, armor rating also because of the gear I had been buying and a huge increase of life on everyone so the moment I started using her as a tank it really changed the game for me we went from I think it was uh, like the early 7s to having that huge run to 812 but uh yeah we're, we're kind of at a uh, um, kind of at a bottleneck I would say it's going to be a little while before we're able to make another push but I am glad to be stuck here instead of I think it was seven uh, seven it was like 720 I know we're getting a lot more experience and a lot more gold and all that good stuff but this is the main team I cannot wait to get Shamira some gear her her heal is awesome. The amount of damage she can put out there if her ultimate is just constantly going, I've been really impressed with. I can't wait to get her some gear. She's going to be a great part of the team. Aside from that, I really haven't tried out too many of the other heroes. I want to try this hero out for the for the Ricks. So we've been starting to gear her up a little bit. Have her as a backup. In terms of the King's Tower, also pretty stuck right now. Let's see what we're at. Rank 356. I've never made it um, past the, the top 250. I have been in the high 200s before. I think that rank's going to be dropping. <laughs> um, let me just see real quick where we're at. How far away are we from winning this battle? I know we're, we're pretty far. Maybe if I tank out Belinda a little more. If she could survive that. That first encounter. I think maybe we would have a shot. But once. If we do. Um, and once in a while we kill the top three. This hero with a scythe has an instant kill. And haven't been able to get past that. So, Floor 97, I think it's safe to say Floor 97 is going to be Day 10 and possibly Day 11. Um, A12 maybe Day 10 and Day 11 as well. I hope not. I hope we're able to uh, maybe uh, switch up the formation and get lucky on that one. Now, Arena is a bit misleading. Um, we are rank 195. And I, I don't see us getting into the top 50. I mean, there's a couple people below our power, but they may have an amazing hero composition. I mean, that looks that looks very solid. <laughs> it's now some time. some heroes that I would really like to have. But the goal is going to be the last day to push for the top 50. We've never been there before, but it, it looks possible. You know, there's a lot of heroes around our power. 
So that's that one's a little misleading. I, I think we could, I think we have a shot at for sure the top hundred and maybe the top fifty. As far as the peaks of con uh, peaks of time goes, I, <laughs> the secret forest, I can beat this first minion right here. We're not going to go through all this, but I can beat this first minion, and that is it for now. I'm not sure how long it's going to take for us to get to um, a power where we're just not getting steamed rolled immediately. But I'm, I'm hoping at about 120k, and maybe with a disabler in the mix, we might be able to change things. The main focus has been saving up for the sheep which is located in the labyrinth and because I didn't know exactly what I was doing initially I mean I I, I think she's a good hero the uh, can't remember her name right now the the Lancer I think she's a great hero if I had it to do over again I mean we would have another Shamira which would be great or we would have gotten to try out the sheep which I've been in more than impressed with heels and some crowd control so if i had that to do all over again i would not have not have spent the 4800 would not have spent on the dust for sure and would have started with one of these two and we're almost going to have enough in our barracks for a uh, an epic let me see if we have anything to throw in the rickety cart we do not And our damage has been getting a little bit better here on the team hunt. I am saving my last attack. Let me see where the recent one was. In the video previously, we were able to do 1.3 million. And we jumped up a bit. Wow, Mythica is already at 2 million. Very nice. There we are. So I think if we can get Shamira up to... Up to Belinda. I think we can give uh, Mythica a run for run for his money. The guild, the last I guess all that's left is the guild's been going pretty well. We finally have a, an almost all active team. Let's see, everybody's a few hours, a few hours, a few hours, sixteen hours, minutes, 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 hours. So there, it doesn't look like I saw anyone over a day. So it, it took some time, but we finally have a full... Oh, we have one. <laughs> we have one. We will see. See if she uh, comes back. It would be nice to have a, a fully out team. Ooh, she has the sheep. Lucky. You should keep playing the game if you have the sheep. You have the sheep and Shamira. Please keep playing the game. You have a great... You have a great team. So we have one player that is questionable, and the rest is all active. I'm glad we were able to get that together. Both Basic and Mythica giving great advice and great help. Thank you to, thank you both so much. And I think that does it for the tour. Tomorrow we will, uh, we will go through the the Arcane Labyrinth. I'm sorry we can't get it done tonight. I'm exhausted. I've got to be up soon. We have the live stream at 8 a.m. If you've never seen me play Art of Conquest, if you've never seen me get stomped to the ground in PvP, it happens almost every Friday. <laughs> I thank you all for watching. Have a great night, or have a great day!